don't listen to anyone telling you because people tend to be little the artisan program but I don't listen to anyone uh, just do what you want Um, I would like to encourage my fellow sisters to up, to apply for the uh, engineering field, as uh, we all know that uh, the the male dominant uh, industry. But I'd like to encourage them to apply because now there are organizations that empower women, like the Women in Mining. Yes, so I'd like to encourage them to pursue that. I'm originally from Limpopo, but now I'm based in Krill. And I'm a learner electrician here at Exaro Matlako. Well, I found out on a, a WhatsApp group, there's a learnership and apprenticeship, uh, apprenticeship WhatsApp group that I joined, and that's where I saw the post. And I've been here for two years, two years and a month, yeah. I've always been curious about how electricity is, is generated and transformed from one place to another. So I guess that's what pushed me to doing electrical. First things first is that electricity is always going to be there. There is no way that you find that even if ESCOM is shutting down or the mines are closing down, electricity is always going to be there. So we're not going to be out of jobs or anything like that. When I moved inside Bomalanga, yeah, that's when I discovered that yeah, electricity is my thing. I've learned that I can work under pressure. Well, I didn't think that I could do that, but yeah, that's, what, that's one thing that I've learned about myself. Yeah, and perseverance.